Hey everyone, uh, welcome to a new series uh, with Ostriv. Yeah, um, it's been a while since I did a, uh, a game with Ostriv. This is Alpha 4 Patch 7. And uh, yeah, it's, um, it's had some, some uh, updates since the last uh, game. And I thought I'd uh, give it a whack and uh, see where we get. Uh, okay, so I'm going to do a new game. Now, one of these maps apparently has an infinite limestone deposit. Uh, it has a wavy river on it. Is it map one? Uh, I'm comparing a picture here with uh, my browser. Um, let's see if it's map one. Pause. Um, okay. Uh, right. Okay. This. Yes, it is. Okay. Uh, right. Okay, so uh, the initial uh, setup of the game hasn't really changed much. Um, I want to find the edge of the map. There it is. Yeah, there it is. Uh, okay. Now, where can we set our camp? We can't set it up on this side of the river. It's inaccessible. This side of the river, however, is accessible. Um, now, if I set up over here... Uh, then uh, anybody coming into the town has to come quite a, a long way from the border. Um, I think I'm going to set up my camp. I'm going to set up up here. Um, so I'm going to set the camp here. Okay. Now I need a forestry. And, and this, this part of the game is not uh, optional. Uh, so I need a forestry. Uh, which I'm going to put in right here. Okay. Now, we'll let the, uh, the game uh, start doing its thing. Now, we're going to need to uh, set up several houses. I'm going to use houses. Uh, I'm going to use houses. No. Uh, okay. Now, I'm going to put uh I'm going to put the row of uh, houses. No. I'm going to put a row of houses right up here. Uh, no. Uh, right up here along the... Uh, really... Uh, right up here along the uh, boundary. So that's uh, four, right? I'll put five here. Now, uh, right, no. Uh, no, I, if, pardon me, the uh, uh, controls are a little less um, uh, familiar than I uh, would prefer. Okay, so we'll put that there, that there, this one here, and this one here, and that will be nine houses we need nine houses to get uh, all of our 
people uh, housed. Now, uh, we're going to need also a thatchery. So, um, production, thatchery, thatchery. Uh, we need... Hmm. Uh, what if we put it... Let's put it here. Yeah. And we're going to need also a... Uh, uh, smithy. Uh, uh, blacksmith, right? No, where is it? Uh, a smithy. We're going to need that. Uh, over. Uh, we'll, we'll drop that in over there. Uh, we're going to need that. Uh, we're going to need a, uh, we're going to also need a clay pit. Where's the clay pit? Yeah. We're going to need a clay pit, which uh, we can fill in right here. Uh, so we need the clay pit, and uh, we'll move the clay pit up here. No, no, here. Uh, right. Okay. Uh, so far, so good. Now, uh, what else? Uh, now, let's just um, take a look in here. We'll probably need a well. Uh, we're going to need... Uh, production, right. Um, we're going to need a whole bunch of stuff, but not just yet. We will need a charcoal pile uh, relatively early on, um, uh, which we can stick right here. Yep. Uh, right. Because we'll need that for the smithy, right? Um, uh, okay. And then we're also going to need a carpentry. Uh, a carpentry. Uh, which can go right about here. This is going to be a uh, little mini industrial area, basically. Um... Okay, so uh, this is getting built. Well, let's um, let's just uh, duck in here, and um, no, uh, just watch these guys. Uh. See, this is the uh, this is the thing about Ostrif. You've got uh, your citizens, actually do the building. I have to give Yev uh, credit here uh, for the extremely detailed uh, work on the building models and the building process. I mean, just, you know, now granted, it, there, there's a bunch of magic stuff goes on there, but uh, considering that buildings, uh, they, they have a procedure to build, uh, the workers actually carry the materials materials around all of that it's absolutely brilliant uh, when I first encountered Austria years ago I was uh, really quite uh, quite impressed uh, and it's only got better since then uh, and even better uh, Yev is quite uh, responsive uh, to uh, to bug reports and uh, yeah, it's uh, 
it's it's quite refreshing. Uh, it's one game that um, if you have uh, issues with uh, like you don't trust early access on uh, Steam, it's one game that uh, you can if you really want to play it. Uh, you can. It, it's well worth the uh, the early access um, fee. Uh, you're not going to be. Uh, it, it's not a ripoff, uh, basically. Uh, the uh, the whole uh, point is that uh, that I'm trying to make is that the uh, the the game is remarkably complete as it stands. Uh, it's not complete, but it's playable, and it has been for quite some time. Uh, and it, it's been basically gaining depth uh, as uh, as time has passed, uh, as the uh, bits that uh, are still slated to be added get added. So I, I don't have any concerns. Like yeah, even if uh, if the developer uh, just ran out of uh, uh, motivation and stopped developing, uh, Ostrov as it stands now is a pretty solid game. And I, I have to say, uh, major kudos to to the uh, to the the one man operation that got this thing going. Uh, it, it's absolutely brilliant. Uh, anyway, we've just about got the uh, forestry on online here, and uh, once it is, we're going to have to put two uh, workers uh, into the. Um, uh, we're going to need two workers in the forestry so that they can harvest trees. Right. Um, one worker can't harvest trees. Uh, now we're building a clay pit. Yeah. Clay pits used to build instantly in uh, previous versions. I kind of like that they have to be dug now. Um, Uh, how any you can demolish clay pits now sweet okay um, right uh, now here's our store it no that's our town hall uh, here's our um, storage tent here right uh, we have a thousand iron. We have fourteen hundred, four thousand. I think that's enough uh, for the. Uh, what's that? That's a resource stack. Uh, okay. Oh, look at that! They uh, cut down a tree. They've got a couple logs. Yep. Right. And here we go. We've got uh, resources coming up to the uh, first uh, first house. Now, I, I could uh, let this uh, play out in real time for you. Uh, with the, uh, the great, uh, you know, soundtrack playing in the background here. Uh, but it's it's just going to be a lot of watching these guys drag carts around uh, from pillar to post and uh, do their thing, right? Uh, and that's not terribly engaging, really, is it? Uh, so... Right. Uh, so, you know, we'll, we'll let this, we'll see this guy come in. He's coming into the clay pit. Um, yeah. Yep, here he comes. 
Oh, he takes the cart right down into the clay. He digs up the clay. Yep. Yeah, there you go. Couple lumps of clay, and out he goes. Uh, yeah. Okay, that uh, that works out nicely. Okay. Uh, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to uh, pause the recording, and I'll come back once. Uh, uh, well, maybe not. No. Um, oh, what I, I want to, no, uh, no, what I, uh, want to do, uh, there's something else I want to, uh, get in here. We're, um, what's a construction office? Oh, additional builders. Okay. That's new. Uh, town hall. I want a town hall. Um, okay. And I'm going to put the town hall, um, uh, I'm going to put the town hall right about here. We're going to want the town hall uh, relatively uh, early on, uh, mostly because uh, it allows us to control some things uh, that we can't otherwise do. Now, I kind of want to put a fence around the town hall. Maybe that one? Uh... Oh. Yeah, I want to sort of fence around Town Hall. So we can actually do that. And then up here, out to there. And... down to here. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, we'll put a fence around Town Hall. Uh, because why not? You know, we have these things, right? Uh, how's the house coming? Uh, right. Yeah, so I'm going to, uh, I, uh, I could, uh, just punch the game speed up. Uh, but if I do that, uh, there, there was, last time I checked it, a bug where, uh, if you run the game on higher speeds, work runs slower compared to the time passing in the game. Right. Uh, and if I put it on fast, you know, it'll build all this stuff pretty quick. But what'll happen is it'll be November, end of November, uh, before the last house goes up instead of uh, September uh, or something like that, right? Um, but as you can see, it, it takes uh, a fairly, fairly long time. Uh, but what if I if I go times the middle speed? Yeah, that uh, that might um, that might get things uh, going uh, a little less um, slowly uh, and, be, and be some some sort of a compromise. And we can watch the uh, the house go up. Again, there's that uh, detailed uh, building process. Although they do like walk in the floors and things like that, it's still absolutely uh, impressive.
Uh, you can even see the uh, the wood delivered for the uh, for the project uh, has some variety to it. I mean, that's uh, that's quite impressive, isn't it? Now, uh, down here, right, no, we're good, um, okay, and we have charcoal baking, uh, yeah, okay, that's good, uh, Meanwhile, we'll uh, take a look here. We've got a house that's uh, doing a thing. Uh, yeah, it's uh, it's going up. Can't find firewood. Um, oh, well, they needed to, whoops. They needed to uh, do a thing anyway. Uh, right. Well, construction is moving along pretty good there. You know, I think what I'm going to do, uh, we've, we just got the, uh, the start underway here. Uh, I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to maybe try uh, time lapsing this, or maybe I'll uh, I'll forget. Uh, but anyway, I'm going to uh, I'm going to run out the uh, the uh, the first part here. Uh, I'm going to do that uh, by. Um, I'm going to do that after this house finishes. I mean, look at that. Uh, the house is just about done. Uh, we'll have eight families left. Oh, yeah. And then, and then you can see. Uh, there we go. Uh, and. Um, right. We now have the Petrochenko family, uh, who has a six-year-old. Uh, okay. And now we're uh, we're working on the next one. Yep. Okay. Well, anyway, what I'm going to do, I'm going to put the cut here, but I'm going to uh, run out the uh, the the uh, the house build. And uh, you can, uh, it, when we come back next time, the uh, unless there's some some uh, interesting uh, point that pops up, uh, the uh, next time uh, these, uh, you know, well, maybe maybe I won't skip it. Uh, yeah, maybe I won't. Yeah, well, next time I may have wound it forward a bit to get through a few of the houses. Uh, uh, and if not, well, you'll know because it'll show up exactly where we're leaving off here. Right. Anyway, uh, that's going to be all for this first episode of uh, whatever I'm going to be calling this uh, Ostrif series. Maybe I'll just be clever and call it Ostrif 2022 or something like that. Um, yeah, it's... Uh, I, I don't know yet. I don't know what I'm going to call it. Um, yeah. I think it's going to have a few episodes in it, at least, um, before uh, before I get bored or something like that. So, yeah. Uh, so, you know, like, comment, subscribe. You know, all that business, right? You know, it's it's still a thing. Uh, you can dislike if you prefer. You know, that that's a thing, too. Yeah, you can definitely do that. Uh, and the bell, if you turn that on, you could get some notifications that you may or may not find useful. So, you know, entirely up to you, but it's a thing that's there. Anyway, uh, that's going to be all for uh, this time. So see you back next time.